Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels, or if you're watching my cha lifestyle channel, welcome back to my lifestyle channel. Hi, is everybody okay? Um, the weather in North West Leicestershire um, is cloudy, um, and um, it's dry, so, and it's um, about average temperatures for about this time of year. Uh, winter in the UK um, so today I'm going to be uh, doing a travel news 10 budget travel destinations December 2022 part 4 this is according to indietraveller.co so um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and a, a big thank you very much I really appreciate it and thank you for um, everybody that's um, already subscribed uh, recently um, I really appreciate it um, so I'm going to kick off with number one um, with, with the country Albania in Europe and um, some say this is an underrated country could be the next Croatia wow uh, for now it remains very much under the radar Albania Nia's unspoiled coastline and quirky capital at uh, Tirana, uh, well uh, preserved Ottoman area towns and impressive Alps um, offer so many reasons to go and uh, visit uh, the country. At uh, number two, Nepal in Asia, um, the kind hearted nature of the Nepalese. Uh, and the wonderful bustle of the capital Kathmandu instantly in, in uh, will enchant you. And um, so, in the indie traveler says, um, Nepal also happens to be one of the world's cheapest places for mountain trekking, whether guided or independent. There are uh, routes throughout the Himalayas. Um, are well supported and um, have many tea houses where you can um, eat and drink and um, obviously sleep um, which is uh, really good especially if you're uh, traveling on a budget um, and want to uh, save some money and uh, number three uh, the Cape Verde Islands uh, can an entire country, a Cape Virgin, the Verde Islands, which are part of Portugal, um, be labelled um, as an hidden hidden gem? Question mark. If so, then Cape Verde is definitely um, uh, one. Uh, this small archipelago ledge off the coast of africa is little known and um, such a has such a wonderful um wonderful escape and um, the island of sal is known for its inexpensive package holiday resorts uh, through uh, although uh, culture and nature also and um, it is also all, all about the magnificent island of Santo Santo Anto excuse my pronunciation um, it, since this is the best um, uh, uh, track in here um, the landscape um, is they say is just unbelievable um, on uh, at Cape Verde also offers a value for money uh, while also being safe and uh, fairly uh, developed as well overall um, number four is uh, the country Romania I would love to go here um, seriously um, don't dismiss Romania uh, just uh, like Dracula and um, it's inspired um, 
the spectacular Transylvania region um, has a whole uh, lot for you to sink your teeth into consider the medieval towns ancient uh, fortified ch uh, churches and the mighty Carpathian mountain range and um, it's perfect for spring or summer but if you equally want to go in the winter uh, then it's equally enchanting in the winter with low cost ski resorts and uh, snow ca uh, carved uh, castle um, again this I, I would love to um, visit Romania um, it really just it stands out um, I hope I do go um, in the future um and visit there um as well as some other countries that i would love to visit um and number five um bosnia and Herzegovina, the balkan country next to croatia has uh, gotten back on its feet yay um celebration and um, has much uh, to show if uh, you if you give it a chance uh, the medieval town of Mosta is the real highlight and its iconic bridge uh, once connecting trade uh, routes uh, going as far as uh, Venice and Constantinople wow um, the impressive ca uh, capital of Sarajevo, which has uh, such general and warm, interesting architecture and wonderful historic quarter as well. It's delightfully budget friendly and one of the most underrated capital capitals in Europe. Wow, that sounds interesting. Um, number six, the Philippines with over 7,000 tropical islands. Wow, that's, that sounds really exciting. Philippines is the place to go. Spectacular rice at terraced and in the north and incredible nature um, with, jun uh, with a jungle and volcanic tracks. Uh, consider the island of uh, Patavan and the diverse um bizarre uh, jazz islands or um botanics province excuse my pronunciation uh, among many others um, in this destination or country the philippines wow um that sounds amazing um number seven republic of georgia um, in this eccentric cap capital, a uh, crumbling uh, facade of traditional wooden Georgian houses stand to Soviet area architecture and uh, daringly contemporary designs. Wow, and um, the capital is uh, Tbilisi or Tbilisi excuse my pronunciation has wonderful uh, soul and character you can uh, learn to explore the stunning uh, Caucasian mountain range and take a uh, dip in the Black Sea uh, vis uh, visit uh, the ancient uh, hilltop monasteries um, a few have even built inside caves wow that sounds amazing um, built in inside caves and um, number eight um, Armenia it's still a poor country it's uh, landscapes uh, detailed with uh, Soviet area real uh, and uh, ladders um, drive the street um, you uh, will uh, love um, Armenia and if you're 
um, into a place uh, that's uh, very unusual um, and off the beaten track, uh, just say. Um, you can have a uh, great f uh, fortune visiting uh, join the bar bar on annual uh, that's an annual event in armenia which um, the entire city of you van uh, fl flights or, or fights um, each other with uh, water pistols so fights each other with water pistols and balloons and uh, buckets so it uh, sounds like fun <laughs> if you love getting wet and even at uh, uh, the police and a uh, life life brigade uh, brigade are joining it's just a special event in um, Armenia especially if you love getting wet number nine morocco and um, if you um stay clear of say the pushy salesman trying to sell you over a price rugs and uh, um train cats um, if you only uh, go on organized tours uh, you'll mainly find morocco to be quite um averagely priced the expensive expensive drops consider considerably at uh, traveling independently though um same as any country uh, for uh, great value accommodation with a bit of luxury consider staying in some of the iconic raids uh, they are traditional hotels with a garden courtyard offering a pleasant relief from the bus, uh, bustling city streets. Uh, they say the Sahara has uh, more grains of sand uh, than there are stars in the universe. And uh, camping under the clear Milky Way sky is the in the middle of the Moroccan desert and um, is really. Uh, good and um, a lot of people enjoy it and um, last but not least number 10 which is Cuba um, a huge network of family uh, run casinos um, party cultures offering affordable and it charming local accommodations you also got vintage cars driving uh, through the sea streets uh, with rum, sun and salsa. Uh, spending uh, some time in uh, Cuba is guaranteed to be a unique experience from any other country in the world. So I would like to say thank you for watching and I'll see you later to today uh, with my next video which is um, Travel News uh, 10 Luxury Travel Facts. Uh, December 2022 uh, part 2 so thank you and bye for now thank you bye